recording. It is recording. Okay. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, sorry. What's up, everybody? Um, so I hope you're enjoying our video blogs that we've been having. And so today we have the whole squad. The, we have the whole squad, the entire orientation leadership team. So we're all just going to introduce ourselves real quick. So my name's Chad. <laughs> I'm Hannah. I'm John. I'm Jordan. I am Michael. And I'm Sky. <laughs> and today we're going to be asking each other questions that our professional staff members submitted for us to answer. <laughs> And we're just going to see what happens. Anna, here's question number one. And okay. Hannah will ask the next question. I... Oh! To you. And we'll keep going around in a circle. Okay. So <laughs> question number one. Okay. If you could win any competition in the world, oh what would it be? Um, that would be So You Think You Could Dance because it's an amazing show if you don't watch it. Um, you audition for it with any type of dance that you want. And then you go through and you get to work with amazing choreographers like Mia Michaels and Napoleon and Tabitha. And if I could do that and win it, that would be awesome. Can you dance for Bob. us? I'm not That's dancing for you right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Sky, you're up. Okay, this one's for you, Sky. Use one word to describe each of your old members. Mm. Mouse. Wow. Boom. Mad. Cross the mic. <laughs> walk away. <laughs> okay, Jordan is in goofy and insane. Insane. <laughs> <laughs> insane in the membrane. Insane. Uh, John. Wait, insane. I really just can't Sky, do what it. You're gonna scare them. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say Hannah passionate. I'd say <gasps> wow, Chad. Yeah, I know. Wow. I need to come back. Uh, what's it called when you're hardworking? Hard working. Hard worker? That. Uh, Dedicated. Dedicated! Oh, yes. God. <laughs> um, I would say, Michael, you're worldly. Oh. <laughs> Vision. Just what? makes me laugh. Just accept it. We're trying to pass this. Oh, I, I don't have a word. John gets me through. Yeah! Like, excited wow. about it. So basically, John, who is the worst dancer on the world? Me, Hanson. <laughs> if you could have the world's largest collection of one thing, what would it be? It's this asking like, this you. This sounds like a rock Oh. That was a rock Interesting. Rock rock if I could own the largest collection of a certain thing, <laughs> I think it would be honey. Mm. I love honey. That was a solid oh, answer. Oh, wow. All right. <laughs> all right. So Pass it on. Thing. All right. Pass thing. Pass it on. You know what I'm getting you Honey's for Christmas? Delicious. <laughs> all right, Mike. If you knew you couldn't fail, yes. what would you do with your life? Oh, oh, wow. I mean, pretty much what I'm already trying to do. What is that? What is that? <laughs> I think I'm going to be president. Okay. Yes! Good luck. Michael, for president. I will definitely vote for you. Michael, I'd vote for you. Like, I gotta know your platform. I'd make first. people vote for you, too. If a photograph of one part of your body were to be used in an advertisement, oh, which part would you want to be oh, used no. and for which product? Wait, what? Be honest. Sounds like a okay, product. so it's like you were if part of your body was gonna be on an advertisement for something, what would it be and what would be the product? Um, I would have it be my head and it would be like, use your head, and stay in school. Like That's it, it, it really be, inspired. It, it would be a campaign to like keep kids in school. I mean, listen, everyone, attention. Hannah, yes. if you could be an article of clothing, what would you be and why? What? Oh, wow. Uh, my favorite accessory is earrings, so I like to be earrings because I feel like that can really complete your outfit and help you express yourself, but I'd also like to be a jacket because jacket keeps you warm, and I feel like I have a warm personality, oh, you know, wow. very comforting, so I feel like that jacket would fit me. Oh, Bob. Yeah. What was your most awkward age? Tell a story. Oh, okay. oh these stories could go on forever. I think it was when I was in... Sixth grade, I uh, there was just a time where I just kind of like I was not. I'm I'm pretty tall now, about six feet now, but I think my body grew into me before my height kind of sprouted. But um, so I was kind of chubby at one point. I was really self conscious about my body. Um, so one time I was on stage uh, for something. I was like in student government or something like that, and um, I had a sweatshirt on. And I wanted to take my sweatshirt off. But it was so staticky. Oh, no. And um, the night before, uh, I was doing something with my friends, and they drew all over my stomach. And it was like a big smiley oh. face on my stomach. And I, like, whipped off my sweatshirt, and off came my shirt. And I didn't notice it at first. I just, like, was chilling there. I was like, let's go. And then um, 
<laughs> everybody started happening. looking at me and like my nipples were eyes and my like thing and people were cracking up and I didn't notice it until I looked down and then I like almost started crying so that was about it. <laughs> at least it was yeah. just a smiley face. And then I started working out. <laughs> if you could have any fairy tale come to life and you were in it, what would oh, it be? Oh, I got this. Chad, what would you like to say first, bro? Um, I would be The Lion King because I really like that movie and um... <laughs> Hannah, you're up next. Yeah, what would you be in it? The Lion King? What would you be? You'd be the Lion King. I would, no, I wouldn't. No, I would be Simba. Because <laughs> Mufasa died, but I, I would be that. Wow. You don't speak that, okay? Sorry. Jesus. <laughs> wow. But yeah. I'm going to break that out like it's nothing, Chad. <laughs> Little Mermaid. Definitely Little Mermaid. Best D- Disney princess movie, and I would be Ariel. Okay. She's awesome, and she's a mermaid. And I know mermaids <laughs> exist, so like... It doesn't even need, it's not even like it needs to come to life because mermaids already exist. <laughs> okay, cool. Yeah. John, what are you going to I'm going to be Hercules from oh. Hercules. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> Drop the mic. Walk away. Right? No. Okay. What about you, Jordan? I could be, well, you guys took my favorites, uh, which was Lion King and Hercules. Well, mermaid is your favorite, though. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? Okay. Um, it could still be a different character. In who am I going to be? Scar? <laughs> no. 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 I I would like to be. You know what I'd like to be? I'd like to be that little goat thing. <laughs> Fill it, titties. Let's go. <laughs> Sky, what about you? Get some Come on, I don't know because I was gonna say Frozen because it's my favorite, but then I was like, that's not a fairy tale. Frozen's so awesome. probably Hansel and Gretel because then I could find the house and eat all the candy. No, and then get that's burned pretty, in the that's oven. That's pretty clever. Okay. By the witch I would escape, you. obviously. Uh, <laughs> what about you, Michael? What character would you be? I'm also going to be from The Lion King, but I'm going to be Pumbaa. Yes! yes! <laughs> he was so great. Was We're really glad you guys watched it. In. Guys, everybody Woo! quiet. Quiet um, in the back. Play! It was a really good I love time. It. I hope you guys all apply to be Patriot leaders. We really want you to apply. We're a fun people, obviously. <laughs> November 28th. I would love insane. to work no, with you. Sky, put no, down the <laughs> sticker. <laughs> Yo, apply to be a Patriot leader and you can do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Greenpolo.gmu.edu. Okay, we're done. <laughs>